3.49 in the morning. I think about this time in the morning yesterday, I was going to sleep in the back of my minivan, and I probably am tired enough now to uh, fall asleep, but I think I'm just going to drive home not too far down the road and I have a pack of nutty bars here in the front seat with me to keep me company now there is uh, caffeine and chocolate so if I get desperate I guess I could turn on my headlights and then have a bit of chocolate to try to see me home to Nina Wisconsin it was an amazing amazing weekend I know I'm on vacation now and it feels really good just to relax, spend some time with friends, spend some time with family. I got to see my dad, I got to see my beloved little niece. It was a good time, got to spend time with friends playing video games, playing board games, not really saving the world or doing anything grandiose, just enjoying myself and uh, I don't get to do that very much it seems these days uh, in a roundabout way I'm in a roundabout it seems I'm always kind of busy doing stuff with work or my projects or this that and the other thing and uh, just having a few days to kick back and relax is really really kind of nice now the reason that I have the Nundy Bar is riding shotgun with me is one of my friends, the child Rollin, wasn't with us this last couple days on this awesome two-day stretch of fun and uh, adventure and uh, just camaraderie, that brotherhood that I've been speaking of. The child Rollin um, has one of those, well, I don't know if he still has it. He might have sold it in a rummage sale. It might have gotten broken in the dishwasher. But uh, I gave him one of those brotherhood cups, too take friendship very very seriously and I always have and every time I see a little Debbie snack now of course I think of my dear friend little Debbie but nutty bars in particular my friend uh, the child Roland I will always think of him forever whenever I'm putting a nutty bar into my mouth I don't think there's a human being that's eaten more nutty bars than my friend child Rollin and uh, it's a good thing it's a good thing <laughs> like uh, earlier this week I ate a bunch of pies and one of those pies was a blueberry pie and of course uh, blueberry is a nickname that my brother gave to my little niece and uh, every time I eat blueberries now for the rest of my life it's not kind of weird but uh, it makes me smile because I think of my niece. What do you do when everything reminds you of people that you love the most in your life? This is kind of like a philosophy that I've developed during my day-to-day -day habits to try to make my life more enjoyable, to always keep me in a positive and happy mood. My, my, my new watch that I have on my wrist was a gift from me from a young lady named Miss Axe. She sent it to me in the mail in a gift package and uh, every time I check my watch now to see what time it is, I think about that and it makes me smile. And it really kind of brightens my day. Now, is it fair? that I get all this happiness, I guess, from these random things during the course of my day without really paying them back. That's kind of what I'm wondering. And, uh, it's kind of a, you know, I don't know if it's selfish or not. What do I give to my friends that make them smile as much as they give to me? Um, I kind of worry sometimes that I don't fill that end of the bargain because I'm sure when my buddy, the child, Rollin, sees a box of Nutty Bars, he's like, all right, Nutty Bars. 
I love Nutty Bars. And he eats him, and he eats them because, what can I say? The guy loves Nutty Bars. But I don't think he gets any ancillary benefit. You know, he doesn't get that smile and say, you know what? I think of my old professor in college every time I eat a Nutty Bar because he was nuts. And there's a story behind Nutty Bars. So how do I, I don't know, touch people the way people touch me? I think that this video project might be one way of thinking out loud of how I can get that done. Because everybody special in my life, my friends, my family, and there's a possum I almost ran over. I'm glad I didn't catch that on tape. There's something that makes that triggers me to think about them and make me smile and make me feel good and think about all the memories that we've had throughout the years. And I really, really want to return that favor to everybody because it feels great.